मैडम एक पीछे चलो बढ़िया थैंक यू I'm thrilled to be here. Thank you so much for coming. Please do come and say good day. Come and visit Australia. Yeah. Thank you. I'm just speaking with you. Okay. Second. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so we'd like to welcome you all to the celebration of uh, Australian tourism through Kolkata trams. We like to welcome our dignitaries, Dr. Shomitra Mohan, Secretary, Transport Department, Government of West Bengal. Thank you so much, sir, for giving out your time, precious time, and joining us here. Uh, we want to welcome celebrated Indian actress, uh, uh, Indian cinema actress Raima Sen, so much for joining us today. Our uh, Australian Consul General in Kolkata, Mr. Hill Borden, thank you so much for coming up with this beautiful idea and letting us explore this in Calcutta. So this tram is going to be flying for the next one month in Calcutta and everyone can have a feel of this. So uh, Hugh, we'd like to begin with you, if you could uh, say a few words, please. Namaskar and as we say in Australia, g'day. I'd like to begin by offering my sincere condolences to those families affected by the train crash in Siliguri yesterday. And I would like to thank all of you for today. Tourism is a major part of Australia's economy and a key industry. Australia and India both have wonderful tourist destinations to visit. I've been lucky enough over the course of my life to be able to travel extensively through India. I have great memories of places like Jaisalmer, Kerala Bags, Agrafort, Darjeeling, and of course the Taj Mahal. So I want to invite Indians to come and create their own special memories in Australia. Indian visitors are playing a very important role in the recovery and growth of Australia's tourism industry. Indian arrivals to Australia for the year ending April 24 were more than 410,000. That's the highest ever visitor arrivals to Australia from India in any year. Our two countries are moving ever closer together. There are now close to one million people of Indian heritage in Australia. Punjabi is the fastest growing language spoken at home. These people are key members of Australia's vibrant, proud, ancient and multicultural country and culture. Visitors from India come to Australia to study, to visit family and to take advantage of our incredible tourism opportunities. Australians are also visiting India in record numbers. 489,000 of us travelled to India in 2023, up from 426,000 before the pandemic. With increased flights between Australia and India, we hope that this number will continue to grow. Keeping two-way tourism growing expands our economic and also our cultural links. And I'm really pleased that this tram, an icon iconic symbol of Kolkata's culture, will traverse the city designed with images of Australia's own culture. 
with Dr. Mohan, Secretary of the Transport Department, to whom I offer my sincerest thanks for lending us this tram. I'm inviting everyone in Kolkata and across India to come and say good day. Come and say good day to restorative nature, unique wildlife, bustling cities, rich, ancient and, mo and modern cultures, exhilarating adventures and so much more. Come and try our world famous wines in the sun. Come and see incredible coral and turtles up close. Come and watch a truly great game of cricket or even Australian rules football. Come and experience world famous Australian Indigenous art and culture firsthand. Come back and camp under millions of stars in our amazing outback. Or you can just sit back, relax, and maybe watch a pair of crocodiles wrestle. You can find everything you want in Australia. And as a first step on your journey down under, I suggest you take a ride on this tram. Thank you. A few words. Well, I've never been to Australia. I think that's one of the places I've never been to. So I thought, wow, I mean, I came here because I was like, um, I would love to uh, visit Australia myself. I have a lot of family, so I've heard a lot about it. And uh, that's one place that I'm, it's on my bucket list. So thank you for calling me here. And I hope to make a visit soon. Thank you. I haven't sat in a tr tram when I was uh, when I was tram rides without telling my parents. But I mean, this was after many many years, and and it's so well decorated. So it's a great idea. I think it's a good idea. So this type of programs is also done in Australia? Yes, we often uh, put pictures all over our public transport to advertise various things. In fact, I have early memories of seeing Incredible India advertised around Australia. So that's part of the inspiration for this. It is a heritage one. So in Australia, it was also a heritage one, this passenger car. Well, oh yeah, we have trams like this yeah. in Australia. They're very popular in Melbourne. They're an iconic symbol of Melbourne, actually. It's one of the things our cities have in common. What do you say to the Calcuttans? Thank you so much for having me in your beautiful city and please do take a ride on this tram. How do you feel to visit here? I love it. I live in Kolkata. I'm thrilled to be here. I've been living in Delhi for three years and I've moved here three months ago. It's a wonderful city. Thank you. Thank you very much. Community kitchen there. I thought that was wonderful. I've loved going to Goa and Pondicherry. Yes, I love the backwaters. You, you haven't, haven't travelled much in Bengal uh, as yet. Did you see the Durga Puja or... 
Not yet, sir. Just I've, come. I've just come. I've been to Darjeeling actually twice, once recently and once 10 years ago. It's still as beautiful as I remember it. So I was lucky to visit there again. Okay. 